The achievement of the trade balance in 2022, which scored the highest record, did not make the government complacent. In facing the reality of the recent high number of layoffs, the Coordinating Minister for the Economy ensured that the 2023 state budget will also support the short- and medium-term targets to strengthen the share of exports in order to move the national industrial sector. Achieving a high trade balance surplus in 2022 does not guarantee the employment rate will also increase. This was due to the surge in exports supported by rising commodity prices, while the manufacturing sector was still hit by the weakening economies of its main trading partners. For this reason, the government will promote short- and medium-term strategies to strengthen domestic economic resilience, one of which is by strengthening manufacturing export performance. The Coordinating Minister for the Economic Affairs at Langa Hartarto at the State Palace revealed that the government will push for the 2023 state budget in an effort to maintain job creation and reduce poverty. In the short term, the government will encourage the absorption of domestic production, with state budget spending focusing on absorbing national production. Meanwhile, in the medium term, the government will focus on boosting exports in various countries, especially accelerating free trade cooperation such as implementing the CEPA agreement with the Europe. Risiko daripada potensi PHK jangka pendek mendorong belanja pusat daerah untuk penggunaan produk dalam negeri, jangka menengah perbaikan struktural di industri hulu ke hilir, mulai rantai pasok, SDM, R&D, dan akses pasar, terutama juga e, mempercepat perjanjian SEPA, termasuk SEPA Eropa, dan juga beberapa e, kerjasama dari pasar non-tradisional terkait dengan... Previously, BPS noted that the national exports made history with achievements throughout 2022, reaching $291.98 billion. Unfortunately, at the same time, the reality of job opportunities is decreasing. This is due to the large number of manufacturing sectors that have laid off their workers as a result of losing markets in the major trading partner countries. Jakarta, Rajo Padmo for ITX Channel.